Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Beholder. For some reason, um, the game hasn't saved last time that we did the all-in quest. The Leog Vistek doesn't know what to do with his lottery winnings and is asking for advice. Now, somebody said that I shouldn't really do, um, horns and hooves, that I should do, um, fruit and vegetables or something, I think. Let's see. Do you want something? I need your advice, Carl. I kind of forgotten what uh, voices I gave, and I know I gave this guy this voice. I'm confused. I got my money today, but I'm not sure I can manage it properly. Right, so, yeah, somebody said I should do it, invest in fruit and berry farm development. But what if we turn to jelly if we don't do cattle? Let's do fruit and berry. Let's see what happens. I've heard that because of the ban on imported apples, Paradise Gardens plans to grow a new kind of domestic apple. Do you think this is a good idea? Sure, the future belongs to domestic apples. They'll make us famous someday. Well, if you think so. Confirm. Oh, I don't have to pay any anything for that. Any reputation or anything. Yes, I'm sure. Uh-oh. But now we'll turn to jelly. Well, we still need... Oh, ho hooves and horns is gone. I still need to find paint and scissors. Um, Grubich asked me to bring him the tools he needs for work. I wonder when we're gonna get a call. Um, maybe we can just steal him from somewhere? I don't know. So what's he doing? Oh yeah, he's uh, he's finding out that I stole something. Let's see. Nobody in here. Alright. She's going back home. What's he doing? Oh, he's leaving. Oh yeah, because I, I solved his stuff. I'm not going to repair this just yet, although I think there's no reason not to. Hmm. What's that? Oh, yeah, stamp album. <clears throat> right, he's going. Bye! Can I still talk to him? No. He doesn't want to talk to me. Right, let's repair the apartment. We've got 27,000 at the moment. And move in... <clears throat> oh, she's the only one. She's looking to rent an apartment in a quiet building. She wants a place with no kids, no playground, and no dog park nearby. I thought those would all be considered horrible. You know, an anti-state or something. Wow, that was quick. <clears throat> Nobody in here at the moment, so let's, uh... Let's get in. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Oh, bloody hell. Damn it. Sorry. Sorry about that. Damn, I knew I should have knocked first. What are you doing here? Uh, sorry about that. I'm already leaving. Leave at once! Sorry. Okay. She's trying to sleep. Let's, let's talk to her. Hello? Oh, he's going to make propaganda again. I'm Karl, the landlord. Good afternoon, Comrade Karlstein. Margaret Sauer, librarian. We met about ten years ago. I worked at the library of the 42nd teaching block. You probably don't remember me, and I have a good memory for faces. Nice to meet you. I attended the 42nd block. That's what she just said. I hope you like living in our building. I will, if it's clean and quiet. And no kids! Okay, is that it? Nothing else? <clears throat> this is the warmest autumn we've had in a while. You're young, Carl. You'd feel warm even the, uh, in the Arctic. At my age, it's always freezing. Juvenile romanticism is inevitably replaced by senile rheumatism. <laughs> no, no, where are you going? I want to talk to her. Discuss war. Do you keep track of the news from the front line? Oh, no. I'm saving my nerves. These fools can't fight properly. If I were in charge, I would have exterminated all of our enemies long ago. Don't you think that's too much? Nonsense, Karlstein. The history of mankind is about the bloodshed. Have you been ditching school? Come to my library. I'll give you some textbooks on the history of war. No, I want to talk to her. Do you like your job? Absolutely. What could be better than guarding books from people? <laughs> I wouldn't last a day in the children's library. 
Unfortunately, society has once again forgotten that spanking is the best way to deal with a misfit who ruins books. You have stern views on bringing up children. Do you have kids? No, Carl, I don't have children. They're the antithesis of everything I love. Order and quiet. Tell her you ruined books. What? Uh, no. I'm not going to say that. Don't really know what she would do. <laughs> I don't think there's anything here. Nope. Oh, he's reading a book, which means... Oh, oh, oh. he's also reading a book. You know what that means. We can blackmail. I probably already blackmailed him reading a book, but hey. Blackmail. Uh, let's do him first. Aloysio Spack. Apartment number two. Violates a directive. Uh, 6053. From 12th September. Illegal to read or own a book. <clears throat> Right, also, the other one, 6053, 12th, uh, her, oops, apartment number one, Margaret Sauer, there, uh, let's see, yeah, he ignored, tenant ignored blackmail letter, yep. Because we've already blackmailed him about that. But she is going to quickly pay up now. Good. Very good. Very, very, very good. I also want to search her place. Oh, thank you very much. I know you just put it in there. I mean, well, that was wrong. Okay, she's gonna... She's going to eat. But I need to see if I can buy the paint and scissors. Uh, there's the scissors. Very cheap. Narcotic, jeans, record. Where can I get paint? I probably have to ask him for it. Yeah. Cruise tickets. But I, I can't really ask him about it. Where do I get paint? Well, let's get in there. See if we can find something incriminating or just something to, uh... <clears throat> you know to uh profile her with my glasses oh is she already coming back uh, i think she is yep chef okay we gotta go and our daughter is reading a book which she should not should not be doing now this guy left I think he's down there, right? But I'm not sure. Okay. Let's go and check it. I like the music, I really do. Empty bottles. Mm, the ship model. <clears throat> oh, there we go, some profiling there. A comb. Maybe we can find paint in someone else's apartment. I'm not sure. Wallet. Tennis kit. There are no tennis courts nearby. That is very suspicious. Did he go to work? I can't remember. Screwdriver, wine, eyeglasses, boots, passport. Strange that I couldn't click on that to profile him. There he is. Watch fish. Illegal object. Nice. Okay, one more quickly. One, 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 he's coming back. Uh, um, Arnold, Arnold Schwarzenegger. She's still sad. Let's see if we can talk to her. <clears throat> she doesn't want to talk to me. Where do I get paint? Maybe I should talk to our wife or someone. Discuss war, news, no. Margaret Zauer, no. It's because of weather, work. Nope. Well, let's go blackmail the guy. What's he doing on the doors? Blackmail apartment three. Antoine Rubich. Uh, violated what? 6048. From 8th of September. 
You have fish in your possession. You shall be destroyed. There. And I can also profile him. Uh, Antonio Grubic. Where does he leave again? Live? <laughs> Not leave. Apartment number three. Okay. Male lives alone. Occupation, printing office master. And we know all of that about him. Government worker. Alright, let's send off that for a nice bit of money. Whoa, that was quite a lot of money, actually. There we go, he already put the uh, blackmail there. Yeah, not really sure where to get the paint, though. Maybe I'll ask him again, but I'm not sure he'll tell me. There we go, money for silence. Hey. Hello. Just want to talk to you. I know you're on the phone, but I don't care. I also want to talk to her. So we'll get them both to come here. Hello? Uh, creator's life's important task. What's task? What are you talking about? I'm a transient. I'm moving to a Class B hostel in several days. What about the leaflets you had to print? Ah, you mean this one. It's a small task I decided to complete at home. Don't worry about this task. I won't disturb the, the tenants. Yeah, well, wait a second. Hmm. Creator's life. You asked for a few things. I'd be grateful if you bring me some scissors and paint. Give the scissors. Take the scissors. Thank you. Is it just me or are they rather silly? If you don't like them, I can use them myself. Excuse me, but everything is okay. Thank you for your help. Okay, yeah, but where to get the paint? <laughs> hmm. What do you want? Oh, hello, I'm Carl, the landlord. I thought we already met her. Dora Noel, nice to meet you. Let me know if you need anything. Of course. Where did you come from? Who cares where I came from? All that matters is that I'm here now. I like it here. It's less crowded than the capital and everyone has a job. You like it here? Hmm. Yes. See, we have a lot in common. What about the news? What ne What's new? Alas, I have nothing to tell you. I don't know anybody here. I got a cold on my first day here. Ah, she's got insomnia. Are you okay, Dora? Can't sleep? Am I interrupting something? Uh, oh no, just asking. I do have trouble sleeping. As soon as I close my eyes, I start thinking of terrible things. And the nightmares. I know the reason. 300. Well, we have a lot of reputation points. Do you know the reason for the nightmares? Trust me, I'm just trying to help. I don't know why, but I feel like I can trust you. Well, of course, because we spent 300 reputation points. <laughs> the thing is, I'm terrified of my ex-husband. He's an awful man, Carl. Why? Did he mistreat you? If constant doctor visits due to the battering is considered being mistreated, then yes. Why did you marry him? My parents forced me to. They're... Um, goal in life was to make sure their daughter was, uh, taken care of. That sounds horrible. No, the worst part was every time I was hospitalized with yet another broken bone, they took his side. You asked for this, you deserve this, it's your fault, and so on. It took me several years to build up the courage to escape, but I finally did it, and I'm now in hiding. Do you think he'll come after you? I'm positive he's considered, uh, he considered me his property, and he's really touchy when it comes to his stuff. The problem is, he knows people from the Ministry of Migration. I'm afraid he'll find out I'm here, and then he'll come and break me like a doll. I'll do my best to prevent this. You're a good man, Carl. I think you need to get some rest. Do you have a sleeping aid? No, I haven't considered a sleeping aid. I'll try to find one for you. You'll see what a difference a good night's rest can make. Well, we do have some sleeping pills, don't we? Thanks, I didn't expect any help. Let's see. What do you want? No, but I'll help you with your insomnia soon. Oh, I'm afraid to even imagine how. I thought we had some sleeping pills. Maybe I've sold them off. Oh, well. We don't have a timer on that, but no idea where to get the, um, the paint. Did we profile anyone as a painter? Um, 
Is anyone a painter? What's that? What is it? I want to see what it is! Well, she could be a painter. She performs amateur in amateur theater, takes photos. Uh, hmm. So her in apartment five. But time is gonna run out before that, so I don't think I can finish that. No. There's no way. Darn it. Oh well. They're all sleeping. There's nothing I can do here. Where's he going? At this time of the night? What's he doing? He's writing something, but... Hmm. Well, people are all getting up now, but... Hmm. Yeah, she might have something... Oh. Oh, there we go. The, uh... Scissors and paint is gone, unfortunately. Accept a private call. Uh-oh. Hello, Carl. Do you have information for me? Rubich tortured me with orders. Okay. No, your protege is doing fine. Good news! An important day is coming. Antoine leaves today. Don't miss tomorrow's newspapers. Okay. Wait, I want to go up there anyway. And check her apartment. Um, she's gone. So I can get in and check her apartment. I don't think I can get anyone new at the moment. Or maybe I can, I don't know. Toothbrush, cardigan. I really wish the game would pause when I'm doing this. Blouse. Now I can steal three things today again. But I should be careful. Don't want to steal too much. Ooh, nice. I can, uh... I can, uh, blackmail him about that. Oh, I think she's coming back. Come on. Yep, she's coming back. I gotta go. She'll be there too soon. Alright, so let's go to him, see what we can do here. Does he have anything I would want? The answer is no. Narcotic. Oh yeah, a bottle of sleeping pills. I'll buy that. I have enough money. I can give it to her. So let's see, can we get anyone in? Nope, no one wants to move into your building because your building sucks! Okay, that's fine. Let's talk to her. And also uh, blackmail the guy up there. Oh, she's not home. Well, actually... Well, she's not home. Oh, she's down there. Okay. See if we can find something incriminating in the meantime to get some extra money. So, you know, we'll be nice and help her with her insomnia, but also blackmail her. Like we do with, with everyone, pretty much. Uh-oh. Oh, no, she's there. Letter, towel... <clears throat> Anything else? Ooh, rat poison. Dangerous. Wear protective gloves. That's interesting that um, that wasn't red. It's something we could profile her with. Seems like an interesting thing to take, though. Maybe I should have taken it. Rat poison. Could come in handy later on. Dance music. Ooh, illegal object found. Ice skates. She's got some good stuff here. I'll take that and the record. <clears throat> and nothing else that's really incriminating here. Empty bottles. Knife. A very sharp knife. Okay. So anyway, thank you very much for watching. We're going to continue next time. Let me know down in the comments below how you're enjoying this uh, Let's Play. And I'll see you then. Bye-bye.